And while Florida has opened up a lot, and around this country there's a lot of stuff that's starting to open up again, it is possible, because I've heard nothing from AEW about fans, uh, the feeling is it's still too early, the last time I asked about a week ago, I, I haven't heard anything from WWE, I mean, it is possible that New Japan will have shut down for over three months while everybody else ran here in America. Well, not everybody, but WWE and AEW. But New Japan may be the first promotion to actually return with fans. Now, one of the, one of the things to consider here is that at this point, if you're going to have fans in the building, I mean, the reality is that they should be wearing masks. And Japan, like if, if, if New Japan says, you must wear a mask to come to this event, like everybody there is going to wear a mask. There's not even going to be, there, there won't be an argument. There won't be 50% of, of the Japanese fans refusing to wear a mask because for whatever reason. I mean, if they say wear a mask, everybody's going to wear a mask. Now, here in America, I mean, masks have been encouraged. And, like, anywhere I go, there's tons of people not wearing masks. It's it's just a different culture. And it's a culture that, in some ways, I don't want to get on a, on a big rant here, but yesterday, uh, the World Health Organization, we talked about it at the end of the show. Uh, they They made this statement, and it got picked up in all of these newspapers, and it got uh, misconstrued. And and basically what they said was, if you are asymptomatic, if you have coronavirus and are not showing any symptoms, if you're asymptomatic, it is very unlikely that you can spread it to others. Okay, now, what that actually means, because this was misconstrued, the easiest way to describe this is to take me and Mike Sempervivi here as examples, okay? Let's say that I get coronavirus, and I never even know I have it. I, I'm asymptomatic from start to finish, okay? I, I get it. I never show symptoms. I, I go along. Maybe, maybe I don't even know I had it until four months later. I take an antibody test, and I've got the antibody. So it turns out at some point I had it. I don't even know when. I never showed symptoms, okay? If you hang out with me, you probably are not going to get coronavirus, okay? Now, let's say that Mike here, Mike, he also gets coronavirus, okay? Now, unfortunately, you know, Mike ends up with symptoms. And Mike ends up in the hospital, and he's on a ventilator. But, but thankfully, he gets better, okay? So a person like Mike, who actually ends up showing symptoms, there's a period before they show symptoms... When they are pre-symptomatic. So let's say that Mike gets coronavirus on June 1st, but he doesn't get his first symptom until June 6th, okay? From June 1st through 6th, he shows no symptoms whatsoever. You hang out with Mike during that period, you're likely going to get it, okay? So unfortunately, this was misconstrued. And if you go on, you know, the worst places on social media, your Facebook or whatever, there's all these people celebrating that, hey, you can't pass on coronavirus if you don't show symptoms. And of course, there's now this, this you know, there's, there's a, large, a large number of people who now they really want to throw their masks away. They don't want to wear their masks anywhere. We don't need to wear masks. That's, that's America. Okay. So the reality is, you should be wearing masks, and if wrestling opens up to 30% capacity, I mean, realistically, everybody in there should be wearing a mask, but it's America, so that's not going to happen. As a result of that, I'm not sure how quickly WWE and AEW are going to open up. They, they may open up quickly, they may not. But Japan, they're going to say, hey, 30% capacity, we're going to space you apart, wear your mask, everybody's going to do it because it's Japan, and they've been doing this since the SARS outbreak in, like, 2003. I mean, they're well aware of this is what you need to do. And so they're going to have fans quickly. And we'll see if the same thing happens here in America. You know, I didn't feel real sick, but now that you said something... See? Uh, I, I had to go get a mask and, and get some gloves on here. See? But, uh, yeah, it, this is going to be a, a uphill battle. And, in fact, i got to be honest, I think the... 
uh, Game Changer uh, family, when they go run in Indianapolis, you may actually see people there who are uh, more apt to play along than maybe it, even in the, the arena of WWE or something like that. We're going to have to see. This is all going to be very interesting. It's certainly a, it's been a certain uh, a, a special sociological experiment so far in, in many ways. And yeah, Japan, you don't have to worry about it. I, I wouldn't think at all. And if they do have an issue, I, I'm sure they will take care of it very quickly. And I don't think it's going to be an issue at all, but Happy to see New Japan back. Um, there's going to be a flood of Japanese wrestling coming up here very soon. I mean, uh, the next 10 days, there are NOAA shows, Dragon Gate, DDT, Seedling, Tokyo Joshi Pro, uh, tons of stuff, as well as these New Japan shows that are coming back. So New Japan is going to be coming back with a vengeance. I'm really interested in the New Japan Cup. I was interested in it before. Uh, I thought Will Ospreay was the, this was going to be a perfect time for him to go through, defeat Okada, you know, kind of elevate him. Obviously, he's not there. He is in the UK or wherever he's at right now. Kenta, by the way, also not in this. I don't know if that's because he's still uh, based here in the States or exactly what's going on there, but he's out. So I, I don't know what's going to happen here. There's a lot of different ways they could go. Um, it was brought up in the, the Twitch chat a little bit earlier on. Is this a time where you want to do the Hiromu and Naito match? This might be a cool way to get to that in some ways, but I'm just happy it's back. I'm happy some sort of you know normalcy. I don't mean to be selfish about this, but uh, hey, we're, we're, we're wrestling fans. We love our wrestling, and you know for new Japan to come back and for them to hold ground in the way that they did again I'm in their camp as far as being impressed in the way that they actually sat back and you know to me did the right thing and uh, hopefully they are rewarded for that by their fan base when they are back to running arenas again